welcome to my first ever vlog. Thank you for watching. Um, I thought I would document uh, my journey to Tokyo, which is actually a year away from today, which is super exciting. I just thought I would share a little bit about my experiences, what I do on a daily basis. Um, yeah, just all the highs, all the lows, everything in between, so we'll see how it goes. I'm going to start with a few basic things about me. So my name is Lizzie, um, or Elizabeth if you're trying to be fancy. Um, I am 21 years old, I'm born 12th of August 1997. Um, I'm born in West Auckland, New Zealand, and grew up mostly with no shoes on, running around, toes in the sand. Um, always by the water um, so if you don't know where that is it is right next to Australia so Australia New Zealand um, not in Europe definitely not near Asia it's just kind of in the middle of nowhere um, I grew up doing a lot of sport um, I tried a lot of things soccer gymnastics um, swimming rugby taekwondo I actually received my black belt when I was 18, which a lot of people don't know, um, interesting fact. Um, and I actually started diving when I was 9 years old and really continued just because my mum told me that I quit everything I start, so I guess it was a way uh, for me to prove my mum wrong, but I am glad that I did. Um, because it led me to where I am today. So, thanks mom. So, a bit about my family. I have two brothers. One's name is Matthew. He's 20 years old, pretty much my best friend. Um, my other is my stepbrother. His name is Luke and he's 27. My dad's name is Adrian and he is born and raised in New Zealand. His parents are British. And my mum is Chinese, born and raised in China, um, so it makes me quite the mix of races. Um, I love it. Uh, yes, I can speak a little bit of Mandarin Chinese, but not that much. I can understand a lot more um, working on it because it'd be a really awesome skill to have. So right now, I'm currently located on my bedroom floor, but more importantly, I'm located in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, which is quite far away from home. Um, I came here at the beginning of 2016 on an amazing opportunity. Um, Doug Schaefer, my coach here, reached out to me and said, you know, come on a visit. We'd love to um, have you as part of our team. And I thought, you know, why not? What could I possibly uh, lose? to come. So I took a trip here, um, I absolutely loved it, the culture here is amazing, the opportunity just to be able to dive and you know continue studying um, in university at the same time which is something that I never really thought that I'd ever be able to do. I always thought that I'd have to choose between diving or my academics so to be able to do both at the same time is really something that you know you can't substitute it's really amazing um, so I'm lucky really blessed to be here I just finished my eligibility here competing for the Tigers it was an amazing four seasons um, so many memories so many people I've met it's really the best three and a half years of my life um, since it came in January when they start school in August here. Um, just really thankful to everyone that made that possible. Um, so right now I am studying um, journalism with a minor in business. Started off in the sciences actually, but if you ask anyone I know, they'll tell you I'm very indecisive. I've changed my major four times. Yeah, LSU has been really accommodating through all my changes. But right now, I'm going to stick to it, and I'm going to finish my degree in about a year. Um, so I'm going into my fifth year, um, so I can train for 2020. Um, after I graduate post-Olympics, I'm thinking about doing my master's here. Um, I haven't really thought that.
that far ahead but for now I have a plan to do my master's degree in social work for now at least um, I love traveling and I love food especially food I can eat a lot for somebody that's five two and a half and 128 pounds I'm so fortunate to be able to travel around the world and experience so many different cultures through my sport. It's really such a crazy opportunity that I have and I actually just came back from South Korea a couple of days ago which sounds insane. South Korea, didn't think I'd ever ever go there um, for the world championships and it was incredible. Korean barbecue is I'm gonna end on a few interesting facts about me, I guess. Um, my favorite color is gold. I love sunflowers. Um, I'm really into yoga and meditation, especially uh, this past year. Absolutely love it. Um, my feet usually can't touch the ground the whole way when I sit on most chairs, which is actually very irritating because it means I'm always trying to find places for my feet. Um, I guess short people problems. Anyone else have that problem? Sucks. Um, I have a dog called Spotty and he is the light of my life. I wish I could have taken him to America with me. Um, but I can't wait to go home and see him in December. I love cows. I think they're adorable. Uh, there's so many of them in New Zealand so I always make sure to stop and say hey to them on the way to wherever I'm going. Um, um, I love meeting new people. I think it's super interesting to hear different opinions and different experiences from strangers. Uh, it's probably one of my favorite things to do is just talk to a random person. Um, I also love exercising. I always f love to find different ways to challenge my body. I do spin classes boxing classes, um, full body workout classes, I love classes, especially yoga, um, you know, love to walk, run, jump, anything in my spare time to keep active and challenge my body, I love that. Um, but yeah, that's it, that's all I can think about right now, so thank you so much for watching, um, I hope you enjoyed a little bit about me. Um, if you have any suggestions for future videos or any questions at all, uh, be sure to comment and I'll do my best to get to them. Um, but yeah, thank you again for tuning in. This is really nerve wracking for me to make videos like this, so it's going to be new for me. Um, but I hope that at least somebody enjoys it. Um, be sure to like, comment and subscribe and um, share to anyone that you think would benefit from any of my videos. So thank you again for watching.